Greetings, YouTubians, and welcome back to Wayne Sharp World, where today I'm responding to an open tag video from Mild Mannered EDC on what is my daily banger. Before I get into that subject, I want to tell you guys, if you're not following or subscribed or checking out Mild Mannered EDC's videos, definitely go check him out. He has a, uh, a very cool channel with a little unique twist to his reviews. Um, he definitely keeps them mild mannered, but he also has a really cool intro to all of his videos where he plays music. Um, I'm still waiting for him to play me some Lumineers to the intro to one of uh, his videos. If you guys don't know, the Lumineers are by far and away my favorite, uh, my favorite artists, uh, in the music industry. I'm a huge music fan and they're definitely my favorite. So I'm, I'm hoping someday maybe he's going to find a little uh, Stubborn Love or Cleopatra or something. A big parade, sleep on the floor. Come on, anything. I'm looking to see one of those in the beginning of his videos. But anyway, definitely check his ch channel out, Mild Mannered EDC. And now let's get into the subject of what is my daily banger. And this was a lot harder than I thought it would be. Um, I have really come to love this Quiet Carry Waypoint and I mean, absolutely love it. Even at the price tag it comes in at, at $295, it, it is perfect for my daily use. And I, again, I'm a sweater. I've said it all time and time before. Um, I can definitely rust some D2. And this knife is absolutely rust proof. Obviously not D2. This is Vanex, a, uh, a newer, very hot steel. Um, great edge retention. Virtually unrustable i have heard some comments from other viewers that they got theirs to rust so i to them i say congratulations because i've i've tried and uh I, I can't seem to do it with mine at the same time i don't live in a very salt water environment either it's just more humid so that's probably it um but i've really fallen in love with this the action is fantastic um flies right out beautiful blade shape very comfortable in hand very slim carry deep carry titanium gray or marine grade titanium to an lc 200 and liner lock and the vanex blade it's just a very very beautiful build and uh meets everything i need in my daily requirements also a super super slicey knife so that is definitely uh in contention here and the other guy in contention is the giant mouse ace biblio and it's one that i don't really talk a whole lot about on my channel but as you can see from this micarta here, it has patinaed over time because I have carried it a whole lot. Um, there's something about Giant Mouse and the heat treat they do on their M392 that I really think makes it just a hair better than other M390s. Um, just holds up immensely well. And this does feel much better in hand than the Waypoint. Um, no surprise this is a vox design and anyone that knows vox relates him to fantastic ergos and i also really like this blade shape this uh this very slicey sheep's foot blade um is fantastic and of course paired with the micarta you, you know you can't go wrong there i also like the fact that it has multiple deployment methods um you can do the middle finger flip you can do the regular flip you can do the thumb flip which i'm not very good at with this knife but the index flip all kinds of stuff so i do I, i'm i'm never going to shy away from the fact that i definitely keep uh the fidget factor um a big factor in my overall preference of a knife i'm not ashamed of that because i just uh i definitely use my knives i do use my knives but uh i fidget with them just as much if not more than actually using them because let's be honest you know, especially depending on your daily tasks. And some days I'm in airports all day and I can't even have a knife on me. So, you know, um, it all comes down to exactly what you want and look for in a knife. And to me, uh, it's a, I, I definitely look for more sliciness than actual thickness, but, uh, this is kind of in the middle. It has a, uh, it has just a really nice blade overall, really good jimping on there. Um, I took this with me on a previous job. I was at a uh, marine base in California, and we were cutting through some material, and this worked absolutely perfectly to um, just that jimping there. I had to really get down and deep. It was huge tarps we were cutting up, and this just worked phenomenally well. Also has a deep carry clip, but only carries semi-deep carry because uh, obviously leaves a nice uh, amount at the top there, which I'm totally fine with. As much as I love deep carry clips, I've really come to the point to where I'm okay if they're not deep carry. So even though this is a, you almost can't care, consider this deep carry. It's more just like a, you know, uh, 
I, I guess you just call it some type of loop, something. I don't know. I'm struggling to come up with the name of it, but I guess I don't even consider this deep carry. It just looks deep carry. But again, doesn't matter. Carries in the way pocket just fine. A um, little thicker than the waypoint. As you can see, and you're comparing them, it's uh, really almost darn near twice as thick when you go from thickest point to thickest point. Um, pretty thick compared to the waypoint. So I'm actually really torn on which one is actually my daily banger. Um, if I'm going off past use, it's the Biblio because I've had this a lot longer than the waypoint. But looking forward, looking forward, I I'm really struggling not to go with the waypoint as my, my current daily banger because I have carried this more recently. I've carried this a lot more recently than I have carried this one. Um, and a lot of the stuff factors into it, you know, everyone gets, you know, you get a little tired of carrying around the same knife, so you, you switched up to another one. So I guess to get as close to a true daily banger as I currently have, I've, I've got to go with the waypoint. I've got to go with the waypoint with a, a second place coming to the Biblio just because I do love the design and ergos. Um, I just wish this had, and this is no slouch on ergos. It has good ergos. It just doesn't have Biblio ergos, which, uh, not many knives can have that. So not going to take any points away from the waypoint, but this was a tough one. It was a tough one, but at the end of the day, it is the quiet carry waypoint. Um, I'm so happy to be back home and be able to carry this guy around. It's going in the pocket today and, uh, I will enjoy carrying it. And this one's from Mild Marion EDC. Thanks, bud, for tagging me in the video. I have a pretty good... I put a lot of thought into an open tag video that I'm going to be coming out with here this week. Um, it's going to be a fun one. It's a fun one with some facts that you probably don't really care about but it is just going to be fun one and it's going to include multiple knives and i look forward to bringing that to you guys and tagging some other youtubers in it, youtubers in it to see what they have because the uh, options that will be made available i think will be really interesting to see what comes from each youtuber with their respective collections so that's coming look for that um until the next one i'm out